So let's look at 2021 paper one. It say uh, calculate the value of tan DAC. Very good. DAC. They want us to find what? Tan D DAC. Yeah. They want us to find this one. This is the angle they want us to find, right? This angle. Okay? This is the angle they want us to find. Now for us to find this angle, first three. We are supposed to know this, this angle. Sorry, this side I mean. We're supposed to know uh, AC. Are we together? So what I mean is first we need to know this. So we have this triangle, this side. Okay? This is A, this is what? B. And uh, this is CI. And uh, this is 3 centimeters. And uh, this is what? 4 centimeters. Is it okay? So we can use Pythagoras theorem to find uh, AC. So SC, take note, SC is equal to square root, square root of what? You say 4 squared plus 3 squared. You square this, right? Eh? So SC is equal to square root, 4 squared is 4 times what? Times 4 plus 3 squared is 3 times what? 3 times 3. Then AC is equal to square root. 4 times you get what? 16. Plus 3 times you get what? 9. So AC, guys, is equal to square root of 16 plus 9, you get 20. 25. So AC now equals square root of 25 is what? It's 5 centimeters. So meaning this side is what? 5 centimeters. AC is 5 centimeters. So we can now find uh, this is 5. 5 centimeters, okay? Now, if this is 5, then the hypotenuse is uh, 13. This one becomes 12. How to be? This one becomes 12. Okay, for the sake of uh, some people, let me just show you. We have this situation like this. Okay? Uh, this is what? Right. This is 90, 90 degrees. Okay? This is C. This is A. This is what? DI. This is 30, 18 centimeters. And this is what? 5 what? 5 centimeters. Take note, guys. So this is 5, this is 30. This one becomes 12. Is it okay? So we're saying C, SC, is it S, sorry, CD. CD is 12. This one is what? 12. Where is the 12 coming from? So if we use Pythagoras theorem, you say CD. Uh, CD is equal to square root. Square root of what? 18 squared, take note. 18 squared minus 5 what? 5 squared. So CD is equal to square root. 18 squared is 18 times what? Times 18 minus 5 squared is what? 5 times what? 5. Okay? So CD is equal to square root. Now what is 18 times 18? We get what? 169 minus 5 times 5? 25. CD is equal to square root. 169 minus 25? 144. Is it okay? So CD is equal to what? The square root of 144? 12. 12. So this is the 12 we were talking about. Right? So this one is what? 12? 12. Are we together, guys? Now, what do we want? Take note. We are told to calculate the value of tan. Tan D A O. Right? Tan D A O. So, so katoa. So, ka toa. Okay? So, since we are told to find tan, we are going to use toa. Okay? So, we say tan theta is equal to what? O opposite. A adjust, adjacent. So now let's identify our opposite and our adjacent in our triangle. This triangle. Now what do we want? Take note, guys. Look at this one. This is uh this is 90 degrees, right? 90 degrees. We're talking about this triangle. This is 90 degrees. So the side opposite becomes what? The ipo, hypotenuse. Are we together? Now according to the angle we want, we want angle. DAC. So the angle it is a two letter, letter A. 
So the side opposite to angle A becomes the what? The oppo. This one becomes the opposite. Opposite. Is it okay, guys? So if this is our hypotenuse, this is our opposite. This one becomes our what? Adija. Adjacent. So tan, tan what? DAC. DAC. Because what is our opposite? 12, what? 12 over what is our adjacent? 5. Is it 5? Okay. So this is our what? This is our answer. Okay, let me divide 12 and say oh. You can say 5 into 12 is what? It's, uh, is it 2? Two? 2 then we render what? 1. 5 into 1. It can't 0 put a. Point then add a 0. 5 into 10 is what? It's 5. Is it okay? So let's look at now 2019 paper, paper 1. Okay? They are saying uh, find the value of cos C A C D. Okay? Cos what? A C D. Cos A C D. Are we together? So here what we are going to do is, since we have this right angle triangle, these things are very, very simple. We have two sides. This is 20, this is what? 12. Fine. We need to find this one. And this one is supposed to be what? Is it 16? It's supposed to be 16. So look at this one. Can you pay attention? Okay? Look at this one, guys. Uh, this is our 90, this is our B, uh, this is our A, this is our C. Is it okay? Now, this is 12. This is 20. So if this is 12, this is 12, so it becomes what? 16. Okay? Why is the 16 coming from the list by the other side? So you can say BC, let's find BC. So BC is equal to square root. Okay, you say 20 squared minus what? 12 what? Squared. So B, C is equal to square root. 20 squared is what, guys? 20 times what? 20. How do you that? Then minus, take note, 12 squared is 12 times what? 12. How do you that? Then you say B, C is equal to square root. 20 times 20 get 400. Is it okay? Minus. 12 times 12 is 140, 144. So BC is equal to square root. 400 minus 144 gets 256. BC is equal to what is the square root of 256? 16. So this is the screen we're talking about, right? 16, how together. We can now uh, proceed and find the cos SED. How together? So we can use cos so car. So we know sine theta equals opposite over what? Over what, guys? I put mass. Then car is cos. Cos theta is equal to what? Adjacent, which is A. Over H is what? I put. I put mass. Then tor, this one, we know it's what? Tan theta is equal to what? Opposite over what? Over adjacent. Adjacent. So which one are you going to use? According to the question, we want cos. Right? So I'm going to use, utilize this one. We are going to use this one. Okay? So I'm going to say cos. Theta is equal to adjacent over what? Hypo. Hypotenuse. So now it's important us to identify the sides, right? The sides of this one, team. Uh, triangle. So this is 16. So this is 90 degrees. The side opposite becomes the what? I think yes. Are we together, guys? Then which angle do we want? We want angle C. Right? The angle at C. So this is where our reference angle is. Right? So the side opposite to this reference angle becomes the what? The oppo opposite. Then, if this is the hypotenuse opposite, this one becomes the what? Adjacent. Are we together, guys? So, according to this, cos theta equals adjacent over what? Hypotenuse. Are we together? So, you can proceed and say cos, cos what? A, C, D 
is equal to what is our adjacent guys? Steve. Steve over hypotenuse what? 20. 20. So you can say cos A C D is equal to, you can reduce this sign and say which number can go into a highest common factor of 16 and 20? 4 into 16? 4, four into uh, 25. But look at this one. Okay, when you go back to bandwidth, if you had to put this line here and come up with the same of what? Quadrants, take note. In the first quadrant, cos is positive, sine is positive, tag is also positive. And in the second quadrant, the only relation which is a positive is what? Sine. Cos is negative. And, and tag is what? Negative. And you realize a sine is positive. You realize this angle, it is in the second what? Quadrant, where cos is what? Negative. So you say negative. Huh? Four over five. This is your answer. How to put it? The last one. We are saying a great big C. They want us to find the length from B to what? C. How to do that? They want us to find a B what? A B C. So direct guys, first we are going to identify the sides of this triangle. These questions are simple. That's the step. Uh, the first step you're supposed to consider. This is A, this is what? B. This is what? C. Right, guys? Then this is what? 10. 10 centimeters. Is it okay? And we have 30 degrees. Okay? So the side opposite to the 90 degrees angle becomes what? Unfortunate. As simple as that. Then the side opposite to the angle given other than 90 degrees, it's the opposite. Of, you have this angle. So the side opposite to this angle, it's what? The oppo opposite. The side opposite to 90 degrees hypotenuse. The side opposite to the other angle is what? Opposite. Right? This one becomes the what? It's just it. Are we together, guys? So I'm going to Sokatoa. So. Soka what? Soka. Toa. How together? So you realize in this case, uh, sine is equal to opposite. Opposite over what? Over hypo, hypotenuse. Is it okay? Then uh, ka, ka, ka. This one is what? Cos is equal to adjacent over what? Hypo, hypotenuse. Then toa, tang. Tang is equal to what, guys? Opposite over what? Adja, adjacent. So in this case, we are going to pick one of those ratios. Trigonometric ratios, right? So you realize in this case what we have? We have 10, this one, right? So you need to pick the hypotenuse. So which ratio which, which ratios consist of the hypotenuse? These two, right? This one has the hypotenuse, this one has the hypotenuse as well. Right? So this one out. So we remain with two. Sine and cos. Okay? So which one are we going to pick? You're going to pick sine. Why are you picking sine? Because sine has BC. We are told to calculate what? Calculate BC. Eh? So the side which we are uh, told to calculate should be considered eh? So we are picking what? Opposite and what? Hypotenuse. So which ratio has opposite and hypotenuse? Sine. Are we together? So I'm going to say now. Uh, 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 uh. Sine. Sine what? Sine theta is equal to what, guys? Opposite over what? Opposite over what? Hypo. I put this. Is it okay? Then you say sine. Sine theta. The angle given is what? Theta. Sine 30 is equal to what is the opposite? It's BC. Eh? This is what you want, right? B C. Over I put this is what? 10. Are we together? Then you are going to say, uh, you can proceed and say sine theta. So sine 30 degrees is what? 0 0.5. You're supposed to know this. I even if it's paper one, no calculators are out. So meaning you're supposed to know sine theta. Equal you're supposed to know cos zero, which is one. Sine theta, so sine thirty is what? Zero point five. Equally, sine one what? One fifty is also what? Zero point what? Five. Cos zero is what? One. You're supposed to know these things.
Are we together? Let's proceed now. So, sine theta it's 0 0.5 is equal to BC over what? Then you can say over what? And cross multiply. Is it okay? 1 times BC, you get B. BC is equal to 0 0.5 times what? Times 10. Are we together? So, BC is equal to 0 0.5, you can be written as a fraction line, right? which is what? 5 over 1. How many decimal places? 1. So 1 is 0. Times what? Times 10. Is it okay with you? Then we said BC is equal to 10 into 10 is what? 1. 1 times 5 get 5 centimeters. As your answer. How about 7 and